Another cool thing that you can do is you can have it look at data. So I came over here to Kaggle and I found some data about the Ritz-Carlton New York and I'm just going to download that data and it's here in the archive there. If I come back to ChatGPT, I can open it and I can put that data in and I can tell ChatGPT tell me about this data. So it asks if it wants to zoom. I'll say yes and include some charts or graphs or word clouds, etc. So it looks like they've included a word cloud, which is kind of cool. Got some information on the data set. And I'll say yes to all of the more specific analyses. So sometimes it throws errors. It's obviously not perfect. So again, you can ask it for more information. I'll create charts and you can see that the rating went down you know, over time and overall ratings. These are just basic charts, but it's kind of cool because it can analyze data. It can also export data as well. So if you wanted to um, just leave in the five uh, ranked reviews, remove everything else and export to an Excel file. It can do that type of stuff as well. It's kind of nice. So not only can it analyze data, but it can also uh, kind of clean up data and then export it with what you're looking for. So let's see if it worked. There's the download. And here they are, all just the five star ratings. So it's kind of cool that it can it can do this type of stuff for data analysis.